Dr. Abby Mark back again to work on your shoulder complex. Um, a lot of people have problems with the shoulder in general. Um, a lot of it has to do with poor posture or sports. So a lot of people in the powerlifting community struggle with that external rotation to get under a bar. And one of the problems that they have is they start to have tendonitis. So one of the muscles that we're gonna really hit hard on is gonna be your infraspinatus. We're also gonna look at your teres minor, and then we'll also kind of come up into that rhomboid and your scalenes and all that so we can get that moving freely so that you have that better external rotation when it comes to say a low bar squat or if you're just somebody who's sitting at a desk and you start having pain, this might be why. So when it comes to the shoulder, the muscles that we're gonna be working on are gonna be your scaling area here, and then we're gonna come down the rhomboids, and then we also wanna get into your infraspinatus and your teres minor here. So when you get laying down, you'll feel a muscle belly or two sitting in here. The meaty part is where you wanna put the ball. So now grab a lacrosse ball, you're gonna come down to the floor, and we're gonna start working on your shoulder complex. So. The first one that I like to do is gonna target a little bit more of that scaling and the rhomboid. This can be super painful using a lacrosse ball. And if it is, I heavily encourage you to step back and grab a tennis ball instead. So come flat on your back. You're gonna put the ball right up at top in the meat. That'll get your scaling and it's also gonna get your trap. You're gonna rock up into a bridge and then I'm gonna have you bring your arms up overhead and then bring it back over. If that's tender, I encourage you to do that for about five to 10 times. Then once you get through that, you're then going to just slightly roll down the ball and you will continue to keep doing that. When you're done, you wanna go down as far as you can down the shoulder complex doing that. And it's usually till the side of the scapula until you hit right here where you start getting out of that rhomboid area. Then if we wanna start working on the infraspinatus and the teres minor. That's gonna sit in the scapula here like I had shown you. And you're going to come on over, lay down, and you're gonna feel around for where it's the most tender. So if it's super tender, too tender, transition to a tennis ball. If you're doing okay, you can just sit and hold this if it's enough for you. If you wanna add in more and kind of do that tech and twist option, you're gonna bring your arm here, you're gonna rotate this way, and then you can bring the arm back this way. And you can go back and forth five to 10 times, whatever works for you. And then if you want to, kind of feel around and find another spot. And then you're gonna do the same thing, sit and hold 15, 20 seconds. Remember, let the muscle relax so it's not contracted and let the ball sink deeply into the shoulder as much as it can. And you can, again, bring it up, do external and internal rotation with your shoulder for attack and twist option.